How to control root maggots in radishes, turnips rutabagas. Root or cabbage maggots, the larvae of gray flies in the Anthomidae family, cause serious damage to root and cruciferous vegetables, particularly in cool, moist climates. Since the maggots feed on roots underground, they can be difficult to detect until it is too late. Wilting, stunted or yellowing plants may indicate an infestation of the root maggot. The larvae are a third to quarter inch long with off-white bodies and no legs. Things you'll need Tar paper Window screen Diatomaceous earth Nematode sponges Lurspin 15G, Tempo or Diazinon Remove and destroy any plants currently infested by root maggots. Don't plant additional crops in the same soil. Place a barrier around each transplanted crop in spring or early summer, when flies lay eggs around the base of plants. Use a 4 to 6 inch diameter square of tar paper or cover plants with window screens shaped into a cone. Introduce nematodes into the soil around plants. Nematodes are beneficial parasitic worms that bore into root maggots, releasing deadly bacteria. You can find nematodes in sponges sold at garden centers. Squeeze the sponges into your watering can to release the insects as you water your plants. Sprinkle diatomaceous earth around the base of all plants for added protection against parent flies as well as maggots. While diatomaceous earth is a sand-like product that dehydrates and kills insects naturally, it doesn't differentiate between beneficial insects and pests. If you choose to use this product, reapply it after every rainfall. Apply pesticides as a last resort, since they may kill beneficial insects and harm wildlife. Lurspin 15G, Tempo and Diazinon are all approved for controlling root maggots but should only be used for specific plants marked on the label. Apply the pesticides 3 inches deep into the soil before planting.